An area cafe is again the hot spot for people looking for that Thanksgiving Day pie, the perfect one. We caught up with Chef Regina Calderwood at Gina's Cafe in Cosby, who says lately her phone's been ringing off the hook, asking for some of her pies. KQ2's Ron Johnson has more. Bake them like that, and then we fill them with. At the, Gina's Cafe uh, in Cosby, we make all of the fillings. Chef and Regina Calderwood here. is keeping busy filling oh, orders yeah. for her I famous treat. Yes. We've always done it ever since I've been here. We're kind of known for our pies. Her wide selection offers a lot for people to choose from. A lot of places don't make specialty type pies anymore. It's pretty run of the mill type. So we still do some of the specialty things: chocolate, cherry, peanut butter, peanut butter, chocolate, coconut. She says what makes the pies so special isn't just how. They they taste, it's how they're made. We try to do things that are local and um, just kind of um, keep certain traditions like that alive. Tradition, Calderwood says, plays a key part in her cooking, uh, yeah, saying it brings back memories. It makes me miss my grandmothers so much because that's what we did. You know, that's where I learned the basis of my cooking was in kitchens around the holidays. She says it's about capturing that home cooked taste not usually found in stores. It, it is different than getting something that's processed through a conveyor versus what we're doing here. I'm thinking that people can taste and sense the difference when it's homemade. Ron Johnson, KQ2 News. Ron, thank you. Chef Gina says it's too late now to ask for a pie for Thanksgiving, but she is taking orders for Christmas celebrations.